So this is how you locate the JRNMA Infonet app on your phones. If you use uh, Android, you go to your Google Play Store. If you use iPhone, you go to App Store. So you quickly on your phone, make sure you have enough data, your internet is uh, strong enough, make sure you have enough RAM or enough space on your phone. Uh, so you go to Play Store, I'm using an Android phone right now. Go and go to Play Store, on this search logo, okay you tap on it then you type jrnma infonet when you type on jrnma infonet then you search when you search this is uh the feedback you get we have jrnma infonet you are seeing open here because i have already installed the app on my phone if you haven't you will see the install option then you click on install then it will install after installation you go to your icons on your phone then you look for jrnma infonet you know our logo already um so you tap on the it it opens for you for me because i've already registered um that's why i'm seeing this particular um feedback or this particular window so what you need to do is for you to tap on where the profile picture is okay so in your case you might not see a profile picture but you just tap on it when you tap on it, it gives you this option, okay, where you can see edit profile. So you see, I filled a couple of my, my my details. So you click on the edit profile, then you make sure you go and then you fill the following items. So you fill, then you click on continue, then you fill. You make sure you put in your bank account number and everything. Then you update your details. All right. So after that, after doing this, after updating, you now log out, and you make sure you remember your login details. Okay, um, because I have this on my phone, there was no need for me to log in again. All right, but if you haven't logged in, you have to log in with your your details. So let me just do that for you to see. So I'm logging out. So I want to log in. So this is me logging in. So I click on continue. So if you uh, don't have uh, your details, if you have, if, if it's not logged in, you have to log in, and th that is what you see. Let me do that again. So if you've forgotten your password, you click on reset password. You get this option. You put your staff ID. <coughs> then they'll send you the OTP. They'll send you some characters to your phone. Then you can use that one to uh, change your password. All right. So I'm logging in again. All right. Okay. So these are the things you can see on on the app. You see all these are nice things: loans, retirement, loan clearance, health benefit payment, guest house fire or food support, uh, flat support, sorry. We have useful links, notice board, and then land features. So that is it for this uh, app. As soon as you are done with this app, you now move on to the, the web where you can go and then uh, update your details for the salary point increment.